am, so. Uh, this is a turn I missed. I could have made an interrupted, uninterrupted video, and I, uh, botched it up. So that was the first bridge and the first, uh, island in the chain of Hooper's Island. And you're about to see something really great. Just pray I don't miss another turn. I don't think there are any more turns. No. By the way, here's uh, Hoopers, actually Hoopers Crabs. Their dock is coming up here on the left. Sorry, that that wasn't their dock. Their dock's up here. Good, nobody's behind me still. Sorry. I made a video of this yesterday. It didn't work out because of the lighting. It was horrible. So I came all the way out here again this afternoon to show you this. We are in Hoopersville, Maryland. It just doesn't get any more quaint than this. Uh, you know, you could pick a spot or two in New England. For the Delmarva, you know, it's places like uh, this. Hoopersville, Hoopers Island, Deal Island, which I, well, I showed a video of a uh, um, guy sucking oysters coming in with an oyster catch in Deal Island. And then there's Smith Island, which I still have to do. And look out for this bicycle Oh, God, dude. Come on, you're killing me. Alright, uh... Let's hope it's right up here. There's actually a Phillips up here on the left. Um, they might have a dock here as well. there are we almost there a little longer than I remember it's got to be it's coming up here around the bend this is one of America's best drives hear me loud and clear this is one of America's best drives I haven't uh, been on enough on the West Coast and you know I mean people can always add to this list this would certainly rank very well here in Dorchester County as one of America's best drives. It is just so picturesque here, you know, uh, driving through this extremely quaint small town. You go over a couple beautiful bridges. It's a skinny island, so you've got uh, a lot of water on both sides, as you can see. One of America's best drives. Tell me I didn't make a wrong turn. Oh, nope, I see it. I see it. This is it. So I come out of the woods and then boom, I'm there. So there's nowhere to park here. I gotta come back and take some stills. I'm gonna shut up for the next minute or two. Uh, hang on. Good, nobody's behind me. Thank goodness nobody's behind me. Because this could take a minute. You got water over there. You got water over here. You got some folks fishing, it looks like. I'm still on the same disc I've been using. I had to clear some space. It's just, you know, I've got so much stuff on this disc that, that's great. So I want to, you know, be really picky about what I put on this. I don't remember people standing in the roadway last time. But it's cool. I got you guys. Alright, good. Nobody's behind me still. Look at this. The water's very, very low. Very, very close. It's, it's about 18 inches or so. As you can clearly see. When there's a bad rain. When there's storms. 
the surge is on this left side and you'll start to see a lot of washed out debris on the left look at this bridge this is one of America's best drives I can't believe these people are standing in the roadway and they've got parking they've got a couple pull-offs on the left it's unreal it's just unreal good nobody behind me nobody behind me we're gonna do this kind of slow just so beautiful Too bad I don't do super edit jobs, you know, and because this is one I would want to add some music to. I don't know what I'd play. Literally feel like you're driving to the end of the world. And well, you almost are because we're about to reach where the land meets the sea. This is it. On this side of Maryland, anyways. Look at this. Will you look at that? I'm driving with the knee now. Don't tell anybody. There's still nobody behind me. This is great. Got really lucky here. This was worth the trip, worth coming back down. Because this lighting is much, much better. Some Osprey nests up there. Give you a little glance back. How's that? Eh, kind of works. Stop goofing off. Look how low the water is. Look how low the water is. It's right here. Too bad there was uh, it was quite, uh, quite choppy yesterday. Almost all the debris is gone. But uh, yesterday there was a lot of debris on the left hand side. It was it was really choppy. Um, hence why I had such a bad experience. Hence why the lighting was bad. Um, they weren't calling for rain. But they were calling for much clearer skies than I was given yesterday. So, you know, that's just how the, the ball bounces sometimes. So these obviously are protecting this roadway. Those little bro broken up jetties. I think I got so excited when I came down yesterday, I just stopped and turned around. I'm going to let this go for another minute or two. Just look at this. It's kind of hard to do. Everybody knows I don't have GoPro or dash cam. So I I'm going to stop giving disclaimers about, you know, don't do this and la 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 la. Just, you know, have some experience. Baby steps, be safe. I'm going very, very slow. Uh, you have to understand, in fact, I can come to a full stop here, I think. Um, plus, someone can get around me. Uh, first of all, traffic laws don't really matter when you're all the way down here. It's great. Um, I mean, it's kind of great. Up, oh, someone's coming. That one's coming. I'm going to get going in a second. I just want to take this in for a sec. Let me throw my hazards on and get over a little bit more. I'm sure uh, if he lives around here, he understands and has seen people do this a thousand times. <laughs> oh, biting flies landing on me. Biting flies landing on me. All right, he's about to pass us now. So I'm just going to... Let this go for another minute or two. Come on, bud. You could, right? Hi, yep, thank you. thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. Folks. That's what you get when you leave the god I'm sorry. When you leave the gosh darn city. And this is my plan. I'm going down here to Dorchester. It is so buggy. You are in a true blue swamp down here this is swampland like i said when the weather's bad you're going nowhere unless you're in the right vehicle and sometimes still you need to uh, go nowhere um that the flies are, are starting to come in the car but look at this just look at this is this not heaven on earth the, what, what the, does this look like those you know little posters that you've seen of the chesapeake little wall calendars that you've seen Oh, I'm getting bit on my arm. So, it's buggy, but beautiful. I'd like to make a bumper sticker that says that. I'm going to reach the end of the road here. I, I don't remember coming all the way around. That's just... I always say it's like when I'm hiking. Just I'm just going to go around one more bend. Just going to go around one more bend, and uh, it's cool. And look, the clouds are coming in.
I can't tell you how happy I am. Well, wow, it's it's zoomed a little bit. You probably just saw my mouth. Uh, I, I can't tell you how perfect my timing was, how much of a risk it was to put another 200 miles on this old car today to take a gamble with the weather. Holding up, they saw I saw some slight clouds moving in on the hourly at 6. And it's about, I mean, it's not really much. It's hardly anything. It's going to pass and the sun's going to come back. But uh, there may be more. And it's about 6.30 now. So, you know what? It says I've got a little time left. Let's just go back. Let's just go back. I'm just going to let it roll and take it back. I didn't have to delete some more stuff on the way out, but that's quite all right. I'm really, really grateful for the small handful of folks that have seen a few of my videos let alone my uh what 18 subscribers i um everybody knows i'm not big time i haven't invested anything in this i don't have a gopro i don't have a selfie stick and there are reasons for that one i'm not that much into this realism culture it's going in a bad direction i think i've given that speech before I don't really want to be a part of it too much. I, I want to make simple regular videos or kind of non show off -y videos of beautiful places that hopefully people will become interested to see. I'm not out here to show off. I'm not out here to, uh, you know, make stupid risks. Um, but I love this land and it's worth showing to people. And so, and, and I'm poor, so I may never get that, you know, great single lens uh, digital camera with a telephoto lens. Uh, I may soon or soonish maybe get a GoPro <laughs> or, or throw down that whole $30 for a selfie stick. I mean, I'm just not, I just want to do things fun, you know. I don't want it to be polished. I don't want to have the perfect music in the background. I don't want to ask some girl I barely know, you know, from work or something, hey, do you want to be in my video and go to the park with me? Ah, damn, there's cars behind me. I gotta speed up. Ah, Jesus Christ, it's so beautiful. Uh, I, I hope they've seen people do this before. They probably have. Let me zoom out a little more. Stop getting the dashboard in the shot. And here we go one more time. Look at this thing. Look at this bridge. Look at this water on both sides. Telling you what, one of America's best drives. If you live in the Delmarva and you've never been all the way down at the end of Hooper's Island, get your butt down here. Get your butt down here. Get ready to get real nostalgic. Get ready for a taste of a uh, small town life. Get ready to have some crabs if you're hungry. Get ready to be blown away by some amazing scenery. I love this land. I, I love this land. I love this state. I love the Delmarva. Look at this. Look at this. Woo! <laughs> I'm just moving next to tears, everybody. I'm going to sign off. That's it. See you on the next one.